appreciate you guys. I don't know how many of y'all just watched the video where we were down at the fish market where he cleaned this big snapper. But literally, we woke up, went over here to a big fish market. We saw so many awesome things. If you haven't seen that video, I urge you to because that's real, real life. Now we're going to Fantasy Island. We're gonna hop on this boat and we're going to spear big fat yellowfin tunas. And I would like to say thank you to M Teeth for sponsoring this video. More on that later, let's roll. So yesterday, Aubrey actually got his PhD studying at Texas A&M, but did his studies down in Venezuela. So he's in love with like Latin food. He told the ladies yesterday, make us what you make for breakfast every morning for your family. And dude, it's fire. When you fire! Go, when you go visit <laughs> countries that are used to accommodating Americans, they try and think, what do you want and try and cook American? I'm like, no, 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 no. You cook how you're gonna cook in your house for your family, I guarantee it'll be good. It's 100%. the best breakfast. Yeah. I love it. Every day on your way out, you come out and you turn down this little river and you're constantly seeing people commercial fishing in their little dugout canoes, throwing cast nets, handline fishing. It's just the way of life around here. And as you go through this cut, there are literally the largest mangroves in the world. There was one place in Fiji where they were close to this big, but I've never ever seen mangroves this huge. Once you get past the mangroves, you go to the inlet. That's like its own fun experience in and of itself going out. And then you've got about a 20 to 40 mile run and you're in offshore fishing paradise. This place is really stinking cool, man. So if you look right behind us there, there's all these cargo ships full of cargo containers. Just as we come out the inlet, the port is on the right hand side. That port supplies all of Guatemala and some of Honduras and uh, Nicaragua. So very, very, very key part of the area. The ocean is so calm, you can barely see the horizon. It's unbelievable. There's a little bit of a swell, but there's absolutely no ripples on the water. So beautiful. It's like we're running through oil. It's just slick, slick calm. We came from South Florida all the way down here to Guatemala for this exact reason. We're here for Aubrey. This is a dream trip of his. He's wanted to spear a yellowfin tuna his whole life. You've never got one, have you? Never. Hey, I know you guys want to watch some spear fishing, but first I want to give a huge shout out to today's sponsor, M Teeth for their impeccable timing. So why impeccable timing? A, because I work really hard to keep my teeth clean and healthy. B, because I really expect things that I buy to work right. Not to name names, but my Elast Electric toothbrush, it was expensive and it didn't work right. The brand said it will hold a charge for over a month. Well, after two or three months of using it, it would barely hold a charge for even one day. So. I call customer service, I don't even get a call back. And you know what? That really drives me crazy. So then, out of the blue, we get an email from Empty asking if we'd be willing to do a collaboration with them. I was like, yeah, sure, but first I need to use your product. So they send us two X5 series Empty electric toothbrushes. Right away, I liked it. It came charged, and guess what? I've had this thing for over a month, and I have not recharged it. It is like a turbo. I'm 45 and I've got deep crevices in the back of my teeth. Well, I need an electric toothbrush to keep them clean. Because you know what? Whenever I smile and I'm having fun, I'm confident and I'm happy and I make better videos. So I asked M Teeth to give all of you a 20% discount, a money back guarantee, and a free one year warranty. That's customer service. And I give you my word that if you have a problem, they will take care of it. You got nothing to worry about. Go to the link in the description below and get yours today. The key to this success is getting in the water at the right spot. Thank <laughs> you. 
Dang it, I missed a nice one. One handed. Brain is going over time, going Spanish, English, Spanglish. Kill the fish. I don't know what's going on. I may be the backup man, but I ain't a bad backup man. Grandote bicho, Roberto Villane! There you go, boys. Robert, when you went down to shoot him the second time, I was on your shoulder like, that junk is framed. What do you think, 85? The fish was. Willie! I'd say 300. Wow, man, amazing. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Now you got him. Baby. You gave him the old Koa twitch. checking this guy out this is Willie Castillo he's actually a fan of the channel we met him at the lodge and we were like hey be our good luck charm and he did thank you very much guys I really appreciate it it was a great adventure a lifetime experience and thank you very much for bringing it around appreciate you hanging out with us when we get back we're gonna clean these fish and then we're gonna make an authentic Guatemalan grill we're gonna cook it up there's probably gonna be some music there might be some dancing but I guarantee you there's gonna be some fun but that's all I got for right now. We'll see you at the dock. We are here in the kitchen. This is Johab. Johab, right? Nice to meet you, yeah. He has been a, a fan of the channel for many years, and he cooked some tuna last night. This is a sneak peek. Boom. Yeah, that was the best tuna I think I've ever had in my entire life. So I told him, tomorrow night you're cooking. Nice to meet you, Rob. A lot of years seeing your videos, but I'm gonna make you the best recipe. A lot of olive oil. When the olive oil is very hot, you put a lot of chopped garlic in the oil. A lot. Now your wood spoon, you look gonna burn. You're waiting for very dark the garlic. Moving, 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 moving. A few minutes. Okay, you saw the garlic is very brown. Be careful, bro. But very hot. Another one. Kikoman soy sauce. Soy sauce. A little bit in oil. Sesame oil. A little bit. Okay. And that's it. The best tuna sashimi you're gonna try. I swear to you. Whenever I ate that last night, it was as good as I've ever had in my life. We're gonna taste it again. Ulysses, que comiendo! We have shrimp, garlic shrimp. Garlic shrimp, man, yeah. that looks great. Uh -huh. it is. This is the place where it all goes down here at the lodge. This is Jody. Jody, I wanna tell you so much. Thank you very, very much for having us here. This is the heart and soul. This is Miss Susie. This guy right here, he's been a, a fan of our channel for many years. And um, he just made this dish. I want you guys to taste it and tell me what you think. You actually remember the food longer than you remember the other stuff. Don't miss the garlic, guys. Fry garlic, so good. Wow, wow. yo, are excellent. Mm. excellent. Gracias, gracias. It is really, it's a really precious. Oh and I want to say, cooking this for you, man. You are a really great fisherman. Delay in this place. And no, Jody's is almost the best place in the world. You can catch sailfish, tuna, marlin. We what have a really the, good day. What did, today. You, what did catch you catch today? today? What did you catch today? Ten tunas, ten sailfish, and two marlins. <laughs> no, just in Guatemala. Muy poco. Mm. Poco. Poca I pesca, I but just in Guatemala. Thank you, Robert. I need try. I need try my wow. sashimi. Thank you, Robert, and dear meat. Mm for Crazy. dinner because 
you helping us a lot in and this, helping all of our employees. The last COVID big problem we have in Guatemala. Mm. Thank you, you support us a lot, and the people really appreciate your help. Our uh, staff and the people you helped with Tuna last year and everything, they really love you, and we love you too. Oh, man. And I nice. hope have you more and more years with us. You know it, man. You guys, I'm telling you, what we do. Mm. About to get emotional, boys, and I can't do that. <laughs> Just telling you. When you, you know, you leave comments, oh, you're really acting like you're having a good time there. No, I don't no. ever act like I have a good time. No. I just have a good time and I show it. Mm. This is a life that I dreamed of living. Mm. And I'm in the middle of it. And I appreciate you being a part of it. Thank you. Thank you so very much. Please check out Buena Vista Sport Fishing Lodge. Please check out Guatemala. I don't care what you see on the internet. This place is beautiful. It's friendly and it's a freaking amazing place to come. We gone.